Hey y'all, let's talk prostatitis symptoms. So prostatitis is inflammation of the prostate. Usually it's accompanied by a lower urinary tract symptom. So like urinary urgency or frequency, um, pelvic pain, uh, genital pain are some common uh, symptoms that occur. Usually these symptoms go on for about three to six month period of time. There's different categories of prostatitis. So depending on what category a person falls in, there may be specific treatments that are recommended for that type. So for example, if someone truly has an infection, they may be prescribed antibiotics to address that infection. However, if someone does not have an infection, long-term antibiotic use is not really supported in the literature. Um, there may be other medications as well that someone may be prescribed, um, sometimes pain medication or other medications that may help the prostate and or urinary symptoms. There's many other avenues as well from prostatitis and normally it takes multiple treatment types to help improve an individual's uh, symptoms. So other treatment types might be uh, shockwave therapy to help with healing. Um, there's some use of ultrasound that is shown to be helpful. Um, we also have acupuncture has been found to be quite helpful. Some individuals may need Botox um, in the prostate or in the pelvic floor muscles. And then of course, pelvic floor physical therapy. And the goal of pelvic floor physical therapy is to address the muscles and nerves in and around the pelvic region. Uh, very often those with prostatitis may have an increase in muscle tension and that muscle tension has to be addressed to reduce some of the compression and lack of blood flow in the area. So some treatments from pelvic floor physical therapy may include external manual therapy, so potentially on the abdomen, the back, the glutes, the legs, internal pelvic floor work as well to physically address the pelvic floor musculature. Could include some uh, stretches or strengthening type movements depending on what an individual needs. Uh, there may be some therapeutic ultrasound. There may be some TENS use to help either from a pain standpoint or urinary symptom standpoint. So there are many treatment options when it comes to prostatitis. The biggest thing to remember is it usually takes a team to be able to address an individual's symptoms. So there's usually not a one size fits all treatment for this. It takes multitudes of treatments together in order to be able to have significant resolution of symptoms.